So when I got this oven, it came with a controller that was calibrated to Celsius. And at the time, I didn't want to take the time to convert Celsius to Fahrenheit. So I put in a Fahrenheit controller. This oven is capable of 325 degrees Celsius. So I'm living, limiting the upper temperature of it. When I got that Fahrenheit controller, it didn't have a power supply in it. So what I did is I wired the Celsius to be the power supply for the Fahrenheit. So now I'm gonna swap it back. Fahrenheit, uh, the Celsius controller is in back of this panel. So what we're gonna do is pull that out and put it on the front panel. Well, I was successful in being able to swap the controllers. However, when I had the original controller swapped back in, the internal temperatures were incorrect. And I can only believe it's because I have the incorrect thermal couple in the oven. And that's why the readings are low. When the controller read 200 degrees Celsius, I only had 134 degrees Fahrenheit inside the oven. So I'm at a loss and I need your guys help. The original temperature controller was a Sycon, that's S-Y-S-C-O-N, Rex-C100, that's R-E-X-C100. Now there's a lot of Rex-C100s out on eBay for like 14 bucks and that includes a K-type thermocouple. If I do a search on a Syncon Rex-C100, they're upwards to $300. The original temperature control unit had a 12 volt DC power supply in it and I'm wondering if that's the difference in the price. So if there's anybody out there that can help or knows about these things, please leave comments below on either how to contact you or what you think is going on. So what I have now is I've put back the, re the replacement Fahrenheit temperature control module using the original Celsius displayed temperature control unit 
as the power supply. In the description below, I've left descriptions of the two Celsius REX C100 temperature control units and links. If I can just replace the thermal couple with a K-type thermal couple and put the original Celsius temperature control module back in and have it read accurately, I'd be happy to do that. The whole purpose of doing this is so that the oven can see the full potential. In other words, get to 325 degrees Celsius. I'm willing to put a chart on the front that does the conversion from Celsius to Fahrenheit. So again, if you can help, leave comments. I'd appreciate it. Thank you.